Nassau Cruise Port top executive revealed that the multi-million dollar project will officially open in May of 2023. CEO and director of Nassau Cruise Port Michael Mora telling us that this year alone the port saw some 3.2 million passengers. So what will the projected numbers look like for the next two years? We're over 4 million. The year after that we're closer to 4.5 million. And uh, it, it, our, the passenger numbers from a percentage standpoint grow more significantly than the number of ships. And the, because, the reason for that is the ships are getting bigger, right? And so um, while we will go from 1,206 ships that we handled in uh, 2019, uh, that you're getting into you know, 1,260 ships in 2023 and then exceeding 1,300 ships in, in 2024, but again, you're going from about 4 million passengers to 4.5 million passengers in 2024. The Prime Minister and other officials toured the site, which employs 300 people, half of whom are Bahamians. Mara says that the current port is designed to fit six ships comfortably. Uh, but it's designed for three Oasis, or three Icon-class ships, which is the next generation of vessels. Um, as these ships are coming out of these shipyards and they're larger, it's not like they're larger by 100 feet, they're larger by 10 feet, you know, so it's, it, and they give these new names and so forth. But we can handle the largest and we can handle the next generation and the next generation after that. The initial price tag for the project was around $250 million, and now that has expanded to just under $300 million. The port executive attributes the increase to inflation and the pandemic. He also provided an update on work being done with the utilities. From a safety engineering, you know, Cat 5 perspective, which this entire facility meets Cat 5 hurricane standards. Uh, and then Bahamas Power and Light, recognizing there's been a lot of change downtown, has been stepping with us, you know, right alongside. And we are grateful to Bahamas Power and Light for the continued partnership. And they recognize that what this is is a catalyst for, for more Bahamians to get into business. And so they're looking at additional supply coming downtown to support uh, we Bahamians. The project will see a new terminal, the creation of an event and entertainment area, investment in real estate, and the design and construction of a new food and beverage facilities. Well, first of all, it is a signature uh, project and it will make the jurisdiction much more competitive. It also uh, will provide a stimulus uh, to Bay Street and also open up myriads of opportunity uh, for the orange economy and the Bahamas. Officials maintain once the multi-million dollar project is completed, it will add another element to our growing tourism product and maritime industry. Laurentia Smith, Eyewitness News.